For the first hairstyle, I'm going to divide out a section of hair from above both of my ears again, and I'm leaving out my bangs on both sides of the part, and I'm going to smooth down any bumps using a comb. Then I'm going to divide the section into three smaller pieces and braid the hair into a regular three strand braid. So I'm crossing the side strands over the middle strand, alternating between the left and right side strands until it reaches the bottom of the section. And now I'm going to go back over the braid and pull on the edges to make it a little wider so the bun will be a little bit bigger. And then I'm going to wrap the braid once in a circle clockwise at the back of my head and tuck the ends underneath the braid. Then using bobby pins, I'm going to pin the bun in place, so I'm just grabbing a few hairs with each bobby pin, and then I'm just going to slide them underneath the bun so they don't show. Use as many bobby pins as you need until it feels secured against the head. I probably used about 4 or 5 bobby pins. Then I'm going to go back over the style and detail it a little bit, so I'm just pulling on sections of the crown to add some texture and volume, and I'm also going to pull on small sections of the bun just to make it bigger and more symmetrical. And then I'm just going to use a medium hold hairspray to smooth down any loose hairs that are sticking out from the bun and set the style in place. For the second hairstyle, I'm going to start this by dividing off a section of hair from above both ears. Using a comb, I'm going to smooth down any bumps in the hair and then spray it with a medium hold hairspray to tame down any flyaways. Now I'm going to twist the section together towards the right side and set the twist against my head. Then using my right hand, I'm going to go back over the crown and gently pull on random pieces to add some texture to the hairstyle. This will help it look a little less polished and give it more of an effortless vibe. Then I'm going to pin the style in place, so using bobby pins, I'm going to just hook a few pieces of hair on the right side of the twist and slip them into the hair underneath the twist to hold it in place. And I used about 8 or 9 bobby pins and I just slid them into the right side of the twist from top to bottom until it felt nice and tight against my head. Then I'm going to go back over the style and continue to pull on small sections of the twist so it has a lot more texture and a more casual look. And then of course I'm just going to use a medium hold hairspray to smooth down any flyaways and set it all in place. This type of hairspray will help smooth down the hair without giving it a sticky or stiff texture. For the third hairstyle, I'm going to start by dividing off a section of hair above my left ear. And I'm going to braid this hair into a regular three strand braid. So I'm dividing the section into three pieces and I'm going to be crossing the side strands under the middle strand. I'm also going to start the braid a little bit lower on the section, so the braid will actually start right above my left ear, and I'm just going to work my way down to the bottom of the section. Then 
once I've braided the section down to the bottom, I'm just going to slide a couple bobby pins over the ends so it doesn't unravel. Now I'm going to repeat those same steps and create a second braid on the right side of my head. So I'm dividing off another section above my right ear and I'm leaving out my bang section and a little hair above my ear to cover it. Then starting a little bit lower on the section, I'm going to divide the hair into three smaller pieces and cross the side strands under the middle strand, braiding the hair in a regular three strand braid. Then I'm just going to work my way down to the ends of the section and then just slide a bobby pin over the bottom. Now I'm going to take the braid from the left side of my head and bring it around the back of my head. Then what I'm going to do is divide off a small piece of hair from the back of my head and using a clear elastic band I'm going to tie it together with the braid. So then I'm going to take the braid from the right side and bring it around the back of my head. Then placing it underneath the left braid, I'm going to divide off another small piece of hair and tie it to the braid using another clear elastic band. Then once it's all tied off, I went back and smoothed.